Hello everyone, my name is James and welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to be taking a quick look at Hass's brand new car for the F1 2022 season. Now if you enjoy the video make sure to leave a like and also subscribe for more Formula 1 content and if you want to follow me on Twitter you can at James underscore Formula 1 and there'll be a link in the description. But without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. So Haas revealed their car on the morning of making this video. They're the first team to reveal their design for the 2022 season, so it's fair to say this is a highly anticipated launch given there are new regulations this year. Now just from the pictures, we can see that the livery of the Haas car has not changed much from its 2021 design, with the same white, blue and red theme being used for the upcoming season. But I have to say, with the new 2022 regulations, the car does look very nice. But despite the reveal and with this livery being used in 2022, I don't think the images are exactly representative of the car that will run for the first time in pre-season testing at the end of February, with some aerodynamic details having been removed. And that's fair enough, given Haas are the first team to reveal their car and wouldn't want to reveal what they have done to other teams early on to make the most of the new regulations. Now the new regulations for this season mean the cars are getting new aerodynamic concepts as well as 18 inch tyres, meaning F1 is going into the unknown in 2022. The idea is to generate a larger proportion of overall downfalls from under the car and try and reduce the dirty air effect, that way we could possibly see Cosa racing. And with these new regulations, Haas will be hoping for a better season than they had in 2021, with the team not scoring a single point that year. But it's fair to say that last year the team weren't focused on 2021 and were putting a heavy onus onto this year. And this is the year they will be aiming to close the gap to the midfield. So what have Haas said about the new car? What owner and founder Gene Haas said, it's that time of year where you're naturally optimistic that the hard work and effort of everyone will translate to a competitive entry on track. We made the decision back in 2020 to really channel time and resources into the VF22, foregoing anything track related for 2021, which wasn't easy to watch. Hopefully that decision bears fruit and we return to challenging four points and taking something from the weekends. And Haas technical director Simone Resta added that this has been a very complex project but felt it has been a success. But guys, what do you think of the new Haas car and do you think it will be able to close the gap to the midfield this year? Let me know in the comments below. But that's going to be the video from me today. Thank you ever so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And until the next one, take care.